Oklahoma City School District Fine Arts Department. We would like to welcome you all to the 2021 Forest City High School Winter Concert. Over the last three to four weeks, every student that you see in front of you have been working hard for countless hours to prepare tonight's performance. So without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get the show started. Uh, first, we have a performance by our concert choir under the direction of Miss Natasha Granger. Trio one more time. We have Miss Charlotte Cotton, who 
who's a part of the band as well, Mr. Christopher, Alan Christopher Coleman, and our first year out, uh, soprano, Miss Nia Williams. Clap it up for them. Very proud of them. Good evening, everybody. We are so excited tonight to have our concert choir in our winter concert. Amen. I say amen because I'm a church girl. So tonight, this, I just want to say it before we even get started. This section of our choir, this whole alto section, is full of first year altos. Yeah. And I am so proud of this group. First selection from the concert choir, Foom Foom Foom. Boom, 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 boom,
organization tonight. I would like to acknowledge some of, some of our singers um, who auditioned for region and made region and state. This year we had a total of five students uh, to make region choir. Clap that up. That's good. We made a song called uh, Concert in Cersei with others in the region, which is like West Memphis Marion, uh, us of course, Wynn, uh, Jonesboro, and other schools around. So they were in competition with a lot of students. Um, their music was very, very difficult. Some foreign language, uh, some was just hard. They worked really hard. And when I call your name, please just lift your hands. Lisa Coleman, she made Girls Choir. Angel Williams made Girls Choir. Uh, Lisa uh, Alto One, no soprano two. Alto One and Angel, you audition soprano two. Y'all clap that up. Good job. And our three guys, they not only made region choir, but they qualified to go to state. And out of the hundreds of sopranos, altos, tenors, basses, and so forth, they all had, in order to go to state, you have to be in the top 20. Yeah, that's a big deal. First year sophomore singer, tenor one, Stefan Wright. <laughs> First year with us here at Forest City, uh, uh, tenor one, Lorenzo Billups. And fourth year, bass tenor and whatever, I tell him the same. <laughs> Miss Granger, whatever. Alan Coleman, chair number three in the region. Number three in the region. In January, January 22nd, the guys will be, we will be going to, I will be taking them to uh, the University of Arkansas to prep for the, um, I'm stuttering. Yeah. To, in, on January 22nd, 2020, I will be taking them to the U of A for a prep workshop to audition for state competition. So I'm very excited for them. If you would clap it up for all of them again. One more thing before I go. If you are a first year singer, please raise your hand. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, COVID is still real. And after COVID, everybody had to rebuild. And so we're rebuilding in our, our fine arts department. And I am so happy to have a leader in our fine arts department. We have a fine arts coordinator. I'm gonna ask her to stand. She has been an advocate for us. She fights for the arts. She fights, she makes sure we have everything we need. She gets us in order. Yeah. Come on, Miss Golden, stand to your feet. Y'all come on, give it up for Miss Golden. Yes. Every teacher need a teacher to advocate for them. I'm just saying. Parents, we need you to advocate for us too. We need your support. And if you have a child up here, go ahead and stand and clap up for that child right now. Just go ahead and stand. I'm proud of you, parents. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I didn't do this, but this, uh, the, this year, uh, the last couple of years, uh, our co-directors, we have all worked so hard together. Give it up for Mr. Andrew Coleman. Our band director. And Mr. Jesse Haley. And I'm, I'm, the, I'm Natasha Granger, the choral director here at high, high school. And But we all help each other. We're, we're, we're a team. There's no I in what we do. And we work together and we make it happen. 
This final selection is a collaboration with the band and the choir. We hope you enjoy. Could you give one more round of applause to the concert choir? Thank you for a phenomenal, phenomenal job, phenomenal job. All right. I'm Mr. Coleman, as Ms. Natasha Granger has already said. I am one of the co-directors uh, over the concert band. Uh, co-director is Mr. Haley, he's over the marching band. Uh, we're just excited to do this collaboration for you all tonight. Coming up next with the concert band, we have uh, Christmas Carol Suite. Now this is a three movement suite. First we're doing Deck the Halls, Old Little Town of Bethlehem, and We Wish You a Merry Christmas. Right after that we will, uh, t we will also do O Holy Night. So here is Christmas Carol Suite.
concert these students have been working very hard and they had a short amount of time as most of you know we have to participate uh, in in uh, football games and so we have uh, a lot of that stuff to prepare for we've been to um, a lot of competitions we recently went to Little Rock and we participated in a parade and we had such a good time and all of this was was led and spearheaded by co-director Mr. Haley so can you all please give him a hand Also, I would like to uh, thank uh, the administration at the high school. First of all, thank you, Malcolm Jones, Mr. Malcolm Jones, for all that you do. Thanks to Mr. Grandma, Mr. Donaldson. Uh, also, if there are any teachers in the building, we thank you all because, first and foremost, it is important that their education is taken care of before they do any form of music. So we thank you all for supporting them as well. And again, to all the parents, if there are any parents that are here that are, uh, are parents of these students on stage, could you all please stand in the building?
Thank you all so much for everything that you do. We would also like to thank Mr. Worship who came from Jonesboro and played for the choir. Did a phenomenal, phenomenal job. Uh, as, as you all uh, know, he was also a teacher here uh, before I came here. And so uh, I'm actually filling, filling in his, uh, his role. So uh, heavy shoes to fill. All right, we have one more number. For you all, I think this is going to be a fan, uh, fan favorite. Um, first of all, I want to give a shout out to our featurettes on drums and bass. Uh, we, have, we have Marcus, and, and I call him CJ, but Curtis Davis on drums. And I know they're going to do a great job. Right. Again, we thank you all for coming. I know we have one more presentation after this, but again, this our part is done after this election. Thank you all for coming. This is This Christmas. Good evening, everyone. 
um, first of all, we just want to thank um, all of the parents that uh, work with, that have children that's here in the band and that work so diligently with the uh, band booster. Um, we have um, just a few presentations that we would like to make uh, tonight, and the first two are to our band directors. We want you guys to know that we love you and we appreciate everything that you do for the children. And um, hey, I want to say this real quick and then I'll move on. Uh, last year we had the band, the band banquet. I, the kids just, I mean, just held on to them like they were their fathers. And it was just a real emotional time. And I just want you all to know that keep doing what you're doing because it's reaching the children and y'all have made a great difference in, their, in a lot of kids' lives. So keep doing what you do. And then God Again, thank you all for coming. I hope safe travels for you all. You all have a great and wonderful Christmas. Thank you all. 